Hi, my name's Catherine Howard and I'm one of the small animal vets at Royal Cannon. And this is Sue, one of our vet nurses. And this is Jake, the 11-year-old Patterdale Terrier. And today I'm going to show you how to brush your dog's teeth. So it does help if you've got two people. So we've obviously got Sue here to help us out. So one can hold the dog and the other one can brush the teeth. And what is really important to stress is that tooth brushing is absolutely the gold standard of care for dental health in dogs and in cats. So if you can get them used to it from a very young age, that's ideal. Obviously, if you've got an older dog or a cat, it's never too late to start brushing their teeth. But the younger you get them started, the more cooperative they tend to be. So what you need to use is a toothbrush and some toothpaste that's specifically designed for your pet. Don't use human toothpaste because that contains certain things that dogs really shouldn't swallow, like fluoride. So use one that is designed for your dog or your cat, and you can get these from your vets. The toothbrush, this is a veterinary one, but you can also use human ones. Um, if you've got a small dog, probably best if you use the small end or a junior children's toothbrush, something like that. So what you do is you want to just relax your dog and, and obviously Jake is very used to having his teeth brushed so he's very good at this but initially you may need to start in just small stages but any tooth brushing is good tooth brushing and always remember to reward them afterwards. So what you do is you just basically lift the lip and what we're going to do is start on the teeth at the back of the mouth behind this big canine tooth here because these teeth are the least tickly. Um, so what we'll do is we'll pop some toothpaste on the brush and we'll give you a show. Good boy, Jake. So we just hold his mouth like that. He's being very, very good boy. So lots of positive praise is a really good thing. Just encourage them. And they often like the taste of the veterinary toothpaste as well. The human ones are minty and dogs and cats hate that taste. So if you give them a bit to taste to start with, that can help encourage them to have their teeth brushed too. So start at the back, just ease the toothbrush in, in the crack of the lip there, and just brush gently. You'll probably find you can only get the outside of the teeth, but that's fine. Like I said, anything is better than nothing at all. So Jake's really quite enjoying that there. Good boy. And then we just come forward to the canine tooth on that side, and again we'll do the bottom teeth as well there. Good boy, Jake. Well done. There's a good boy. There we go. And then again, we would do exactly the same on the opposite side because those teeth are the least tickly before we work our way to the front ones, which are the incisors. So I'll just show you the incisors for the video. So we just put a bit more toothpaste on. Good boy. Good boy, Jake. Well done. There we go. So he's just accepting that really quite well there. Just like that. Just letting me brush them all. Good boy. And the bottom ones there as well. Well done. That was very good, Jake. So that's how we'd recommend you brush your dog's teeth at Royal Canyon.